Hey guys, anytime you have tried shooting videos from your mobile phone, if yes, you must have sometimes observed that there is some sort of flickering while you're trying to shoot the video. Why is that happening? Let's understand a reason, one of the reason behind it in this particular video. So stay tuned with me. So definitely, you must have also tried taking an image from the mobile phone and that, that doesn't show any flickering, okay. But when you try to put it on the video mode, especially at 60 FPS, at the FPS around 60, you commonly see the flickering, especially in an atmosphere where you're connected with huge LED lights. Now LEDs operate at AC, okay. And the supply uh, frequency in our country is 50 Hertz, in US it's 60 Hertz of course. That means 50 cycles in one particular second. 50 cycles in one particular second. Okay, and in one cycle, the LED will go on and off. That is two times. Okay, so you have nearly 100 times on and off coming up in one particular second and such a high on and off rate cannot be of course observed by the naked eyes. Okay, normally when you see any particular, normally when you enter a room, you know, full illuminated with LED lights, you don't see flickering by the naked eyes. Of course not. Okay, but when you take it from the mobile phone, in the video mode. Now video is what? It is a continuous shot of images. Okay, FPS. When I'm talking about the term FPS, it simply means frames per second. Okay, how many frames you're shooting per second? Your mobile is shooting per second. That defines the FPS of the video. Okay, so if you shoot it at 60 FPS, let's have a look. Okay, when you shoot it at 60 FPS, clearly now you're able to see that there is some flickering coming up here. But now let me change the resolution. Let me put it to 30 FPS. Here you see guys, here you see the flickering goes away. Same room, same mobile phone, same atmosphere, same lightning, the flickering goes away. Okay, I hope you have got some logic. Yes, so as I'm mentioning you, the LEDs which operate at supply frequency of 50 and your when your mobile phone is shooting at 60 FPS, that is, very close to the supply frequency it is able to you know observe it is able to record all the fluctuations of the led and that is why you see the flickering the on and off the on and off behavior that turns up in front of you in the form of flickering but at the same time when you put it as 30 at the lower fps it is not able to record the higher frequency the higher on off rate of uh, the led and hence you don't observe the flickering at the lower fps and also with the naked eyes of course also what happens when you go to the bright sunlight Okay, or, or, or in any natural light. Okay, do you observe flickering? Not at all. Have a look into this. Okay, whatever the time of the day may be, but when you shoot it in the natural light, you don't observe flickering. The simple reason is, guys, the sun doesn't flicker. It's it's a continuous source of light, and that is why you will never observe flickering. Okay, flickering is observed when you have okay a source like LED supplied with the okay the uh, AC sinusoidal supply. Okay, so now one of the way to avoid the flickering. Now, why I want to tell you this because you know many people, especially they want to shoot and they say the flickering. Okay, you know they feel ki okay maybe the maybe there is some defect in the camera or some people believe ki okay the lighting is not appropriate. Let me move out of this room and go shoot somewhere else. No, you have some options. You have some solutions. Okay, number one, as I clearly told you, adjust the FPS. Of course, there is a role of shutter speed of the camera also. But in this particular video, I am focusing on the FPS part. Adjust the FPS. Okay, try to adjust the FPS of your mobile phone and and you will see that the flickering goes away. Number two possibility is also you can try adjusting the uh, adjusting the brightness of the room if possible because sometimes in low brightness also you will not see the flickering. Okay, but of course you know if you are compromising with the brightness of the room sometimes that may hurt the quality of the video. So that's not that suggestible. And number three natural remedies you can shoot you can prefer shooting in the open uh, natural light. Of course the flickering is never seen there whether you are shooting video or taking an image. So hope this video has given you some insights about you know what actually FPS is. Okay, and you should never worry if you have flickering. It's all natural. It's all a scientific process. Okay, there is nothing defect. There's nothing wrong with your camera and hope at least by adjusting the FPS you can, you know, shoot at a place which you were not able to shoot right now. Okay, so small video talking about FPS, the connection with the frequency. Okay, and why does the uh, videos flicker. Thank you and stay subscribed to Baiju's exam prep if you want to get more such usual information. Thank you.